major drone attacks and drone attacks have been intensified. Of course, it's nothing to do with the NATO, as you said, but it has been these all drone attacks in order to reduce pressure on NATO troops inside Afghanistan. So the 18 people have been killed so far in the last 24 hours, and 12 of them, uh, the authorities claim, were Haqqani Network militant. Are in any way these attacks in Pakistan, inside Pakistan and helping uh, NATO forces inside Afghanistan, are you feeling any effect of militant activities is reducing inside Afghanistan? Uh, first of all, uh, let me stress once again that uh, um, uh, we operate uh, within uh, the mandate uh, provided by the United Nations. Uh, so we operate uh, within uh, Afghan uh, borders. So I have no, no comments whatsoever uh, on um, the um, alleged uh, drone uh, strikes. But in general, uh, I can assure you that it has, of course, an impact uh, on our operations uh, in Afghanistan, uh, whether uh, terrorists and uh, extremists in the border region um, uh, are, um, uh, or the, the threat uh, from terrorists and, uh, and extremists in the border region uh, are addressed uh, or not. Uh, and this is also a reason why we have uh, encouraged uh, the Pakistani military and the Pakistani government uh, to step up uh, their uh, fight uh, against uh, terrorists uh, in the border region. I, I had an opportunity to discuss this with Pakistani leaders some weeks ago when I visited uh, Pakistan. So in general, yes. Uh, um, the cross-border activities uh, between Pakistan and Afghanistan uh, have, of course, an impact uh, on our operations uh, in Afghanistan.